all right what is going on welcome to the channel all right we're gonna be doing a quick summon test in this video here uh so this is my co-worker john and he's gonna be uh trying to break summon because he's never actually used it so i'm actually putting him through the test to see that's his tesla back there mando and he's just thinking about you know potentially getting fsd but I gotta try to sell it to him, right? So here's, here's the, you know, he's not the biggest fan on FSD, but I think he's interested in summon. So, you know, now that my car just received ass over the internet, right? Um, maybe, do you, do you know how to use it? I could go to Target. Okay. Yeah, so you have to hold it. It's not hands-free yet. Hold the go to target. You have to hold it as long as you want it, right? It's it will one day be hands-free, but we're not there yet. We we just start we're just starting giving people this. Because this is already a lot. You know? Um Yeah, so now we have to look like idiots and run after the car. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but of course you want to try this in a private area where there's no cars or people but if there are cars and people it's it's smart enough to figure it out it's not it's not dumb this is a smart summon not dumb summon oh perfect we've got a car this he was here the other day too when i made a video he keeps getting freaked out every time i make a video he's like you're doing that with your phone oh by the way this is a preview of 1010 oh my god it wants to park what are you doing Oh, that would be nuts if you get it to park <laughs> honestly um but yeah anyway so at 10 10 they're going to be shooting it on a on a movie lot warner brothers studio in la this is our little preview we're shooting 10 10 right here in the northern virginia lot with all the data centers and uh it's doing its thing uh you, you want to try to maybe turn the corner Oh, that, that might be a little challenging. You know, I mean, look, if it's possible, it's possible, but... Okay, so we moved the circle, so it should go around the corner now. Yeah, because you've, you've increased, right? You could try to make it come back to us, but I, I would try to continue the circle, right? Let, let's see if we can have it actually go around. Let's see. All right. And look, this time we've got cars in the way right and it was able to get through the cars no problem it could have kept all the way through the cars but we're trying to pace ourselves here getting some laps in on our lunch break at the same time all right last time he was out here he got really freaked out he was like because i was sitting in my back seat <laughs> doing this and uh yeah check out the data center out there that is really awesome what's going on over there so what I see, and maybe in the next generation of upgrades, they'll have parking spots because you can automatically park your car if you're in it. They call it banish. 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 That's what it's going to so, be. So yeah. We're gonna link that uh, that summon to that, so it can read lines and park in it. Bingo. Because like right now, I would have to sit in the driver's seat, make yes. it park itself, you know, which is possible. Like I could technically do it, but at the same time, look on 1010 fsd becomes a hardware product right now fsd is just software but on 1010 tesla's coming out with a new car that has this software built into it okay so it's gonna be robo taxi in real life the other day it was like uh sunny out here i had it park in the shade it's kind of funny it worked shout out to my buddies miata over here old school classic classic car right here this is a um not a hot wheel that's the real thing all right so We've gone around the building. what do we call it sir ma'am person i'm not sure what to call it uh but car come back to me no i'm just kidding <laughs> so there's this one button over there that says come to me right so let's try it now that it's facing the other way. Let's see if we can get it to come back here. I don't know what it's going to do. Go in reverse all the way down. I'm not sure. Uh-oh, it's confused. Struck out. <laughs> Struck out. Well, now look, there's a directional pad over there, right? You could go forward or back. Just hit the back. 
right let's see how far i can go and hold it you may have to move out of its path right because look if i jump in front of its path right now <laughs> oh and it stops perfectly look it will not continue with people which is perfect you know i've been wanting to try this out actually that's awesome and look as soon as i move out of its way it'll but see it does need to straighten now because it knows if it backs up it's going to go into the curve so it is smarter Let, let's just say it drives better than some summon fsd drives better than most summon is it's still like a 12 year old here driving you know but you know i read this story the other day some eight year old drove to target all by herself Turn on its own. No, so I don't think it, FSD can't do the three point turn on it, it can't yet. But if you could do the three point turn, that would be critical here. I don't think it can do it. This is where it messes up. Okay. This is usually where I have to get in, right? I'm like, all right, that is where I call, I call it quits. So, what do so you think? Hopefully, we get an update soon. But from what I've seen, that's pretty epic. So <laughs> if I'm parked down here, yeah, and I'm working and it's starting to rain. Yeah, oh, yeah, I can draw to have it come right up to that door and Any pick day. me up. Yeah. So, I would say for the where it's at, it's it's awesome, it's a hundred percent of where it's at. But the updates, once they be able to do the three point turn and parking into a spot like you can while you're in the car, imagine then you're off the chain. Imagine you can pick parking spots like that right on the map. Oh. So, that's the next generation. Guys, if you don't have FSD or Summon, I highly suggest you get it. Yeah, all right, look, that's coming from a Tesla owner who doesn't have it. And uh, look, man, I'm, I'm not trying to like sell it to you because I know you have a Tesla and I know I'm not trying to say, hey, you drive better right. than the FSD or whatever, but, but it's, it, it's crucial and it comes into it, it's practical when you're in the rain or in a parking spot and, yeah. and, and it can come and get you instead of you going to get it. I think it's thumbs up for me all the way. Sweet. Hey man, thanks for the review. Appreciate it. Uh, shout out to everyone who made it this far in the video and uh, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe for more videos like this. FSD, um, I think 12.69 is coming out on Christmas, right? So that's that maybe all this stuff that he's talking about might actually show up around Christmas, right? Wouldn't be surprised at the rate that they go and they've even, um, they kept their promise on all of the September releases. They said FSD Cybertruck, right? And um, I know a couple people with the FSD on, that just got it on their Cybertruck and they will be coming to the light show, uh, which is gonna be uh, October 18th, Frederick Airport. So if you're a Tesla local, come through and uh, yeah. Make sure to um, bring your Tesla and uh, light up for world peace, right? Hey, all right, so thanks again for watching and uh, we're gonna go park the car. Cheers.